Hi, kindergarten. Our writing this week, I wanted to make it related to animals since we're talking a lot about animals and habitats in science. So your family's going to get this little scan sheet of paper, which again, if you don't have availability to print, you could just simply um, make some subtitles and follow the interesting um, stuff that we are going to research, okay? So what I need you to do is go ahead this week and pick one of your favorite animals. So you might have many, but try to just think of one particular animal that you want to kind of study a little bit more about this week, okay? So I'm going to show you my favorite animal, and I made my favorite animal out of clay. Now, it says here that what you're going to do is draw a picture. So remember, do everything in pencil first, because if you make a mistake, you can always go back. So you're going to draw me a picture of what your animal looks like. You're also going to write your animal's name up here. You're going to write maybe just two facts, because I know you don't have a ton of room, but maybe you can write two interesting facts about your animal. And you're also going to write what habitat they live in. And you know different habitats that animals can live in. There's many, many habitats. You're going to try to write that one here, where, wherever they live. And then any other important information, maybe what's something they like to eat. Or um, are they extinct now? You could, you know, just go ahead and tell me any information that you might want to also write down here in the box. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you. All right, now, you don't have to do this um like the same way i did you can even draw a picture uh just in your box you could paint a mural you can use modeling clay you can use a shoe box if you want to make it fun and interesting to create your habitat for your animal so i'm just going to show you the animal that i made out of play-doh and let's see if you guys can help me guess now it's still a little bit delicate because i i made it so what do you guys think if i'm holding this up can you see this is supposed to be a giraffe. A giraffe is my favorite animal. So a giraffe, boys and girls, they can live in savannas or grasslands. An interesting fact about the giraffe is that they're the tallest mammal, and they also can run up to about 35 miles an hour. Um, they love um, to eat tall trees and plants. They also have black tongues. I think they're really cute and fun animals to observe. Now, if I want to go and watch these animals, I, of course, have to go to the zoo, right, to see them because, um, of course, we don't live near savannas or grasslands or anything like that to go see them. Um, but they are really fun, interesting animals, and um, I just wanted to share mine with you so that you can get to design and create your own animal this week and you could simply just research that by reading the stories and uh, watching the videos as well as um, different uh, things that I post through YouTube. You're going to get to learn a lot about animals this week guys so go ahead and, and think about your favorite animal and then after you brainstorm what your fa favorite animal is you're going to do a little bit of research on them through telling me some interesting facts where they live and um, some other important information that you might want to uh, share. All right, so have fun with this. And this is very something simple. You can do it all in pencil. And like I said, you can be as creative as you want. You can use a shoe box to create the habitat. You can make your animal out of clay or paint or just simply use your crayons. Have fun with this, guys. And I would love to see these on your um, the Flipgrid, okay? Take care, bye-bye.